Hey, what's happening, guys? Take a look at this. This is a uh, Life PO4, uh, you know, lithium iron phosphate power station from Browley. This is the same company that uh, created the one that had the built in solar panels that opened up like a suitcase I showed you a couple of months ago. Well, this one um, is really cool. It's 288 watt hours, 300 watts continuous, 600 watts max. It's got a really unique little OLED screen here. And then down at the bottom here, it's got a thermometer and a, uh, whoa, sorry about that. Hope nobody fell out of their chair. Anyway, it's got a hygrometer and a uh, thermometer. So you can get the temperature and the humidity. And the reason they have this is they are marketing this as a uh, camping and I think it is uh, pretty cool for that. Let's take a quick look here. All of your inputs and outputs have these nice rubber weather-resistant covers. So we have a 12-volt car-type outlet. And yes, it comes with the charging cables you need for that. We have one pure sine wave, 110 volt, 3 watt output. I would have liked to have seen two. But, you can always put a splitter in. Now, if we come over here, we have our input for the charging, and it comes with an adapter here. This is the adapter it comes with. 15 volts, 4 amps, 60 watts, center positive. Then we have two uh, DC outputs here. And once again, you get a cord to work with it. Oh, I just showed you that one. So down here we have our USB. We have two USB 3.0. We have USB-C 100 watts in and out, and USB-C 18 watts out. So we have a total of what? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 outputs. So you can run 8 different outputs at a time here, which is very cool. Let's take a look at this screen here. huh? So the screen is about 2 inches diameter, 50 millimeters. And you can see right now it's just telling us the battery is at 100%. If I hit the DC button, you see now it says out DC and it's telling us our watts. Now we have AC and DC. So we can run them both like that at the same time quite easily. It's nice to have this here. Now on the other side over here, we've got the fan down at the bottom. And you know that every product out of China has to come with a flashlight. So we've got a light, which has separate modes. And then, like I said, down here we have our fan. Now, they've tried, like, I would call this like a little steampunky looking thing. They put this nice little leather. package on here you're not going to hold much in here but it's nice and it it will come off you also get the overhead uh, shoulder strap which I tried to use with my uh, leaf blower note this will not run a leaf blower but it was all just experimental so you know what'd you expect right so I think where this is going to be best is going to be charging your electronics, batteries, cameras, phones, laptops, uh, tablets, whatever, running small lights and small appliances. So let's uh let's get out the USB C cable that is shipped with. Oop plug her in there turn on the DC 
and I will plug it into my Pixel 6 Pro, which seems to be charging just fine. And if we look here at the screen, you can see it is charging 9 watts, no problem. Let's add in some AC. Excuse me. Here is a 30 watt UV light panel. So I can plug in, activate the AC, and then hit the switch. And now we've got UV light as well. So we're putting out DC and AC. And if we come down here and look, you can see out AC is 35 watts. I guess that's total wattage output for both. But you see we have out DC and <clears throat> out AC. So pretty nice. Small uh, capacity, 288 watt hours. Uh... Like I said, 300 watts continuous. Comes with everything you need, except the solar panels. It doesn't come with a set of solar panels. But this thing is on sale right now for $199. I mean, come on. $199 bucks to give you a source of AC and DC power that you can take pretty much anywhere. I mean, if you live in an area that experiences power outages or, you know, you're an outdoor enthusiast, something like this might be right up your alley. So I hope you enjoyed this video, and if you did, I hope that you will give me a thumbs up. Feel free to comment, share, and don't forget to subscribe. Big thanks to all the patrons, and a big thanks to Browie for sending this out for our consideration. That's it. I'm out. Peace.